Hey guys, what's up? Hope you guys are doing really well. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna do a drugstore haul today. This is like, I guess, a collective haul, like where you've like accumulated stuff from the drugstore. This is not one stop drugstore kind of thing. This is like stuff I've accumulated over like multiple trips to like Target, Walmart, CVS, Walgreens. Just when I have to go get regular stuff from like Target and Walmart, I just pick up makeup because you know how you are. You go into Target for one thing and then you end up coming out with like 20 different things of makeup. So I think that's like everybody else. So I'm gonna go ahead and start. Some of them are actually, some of my stuff is out of their packaging because I just decided to use it. Um, so yeah, but I decided to just go ahead and do a collective haul anyway. This is their L'Oreal, <laughs> L'Oreal. It's a carbon, voluminous carbon black mascara. I actually like this one and I decided to pick up another two because I haven't used it in so long and I figured I would just want to use it anyway. Now I found out about these from a blog post that they were finally coming out this year and it took forever for them to launch them and they just launched like I think a week ago or a couple days ago and I found them at a Walmart and they are the new L'Oreal La Palette Nude. If I can catch them, hope they don't, yeah they have a glare on them but they're the new ones. They're these um, this is the first one and this is the second one. They're the new La Palette Nude palettes that L'Oreal launched this year and I found out about them last year that they were going to launch this year on like Instagram and um, I think Twitter and the blog I follow. So yeah, that is what I found about. I'm so excited to break into those. I'll do a full review on them. Two Jordana Matte Modern Matte Lipsticks. I got Matte Teeth and Matte Blush. I heard so many good reviews about these so I decided to just pick two up myself. I'm actually wearing this one today so and I love these so far. These are really pretty. Um, so yeah, I, <laughs> I dropped it, but yeah, I'm really excited to try those out. Got a whole bunch of stuff for hard candy. I did not know they were releasing so much new stuff. There's so much new stuff in the drugstore. It's absolutely insane. So there's the hard candy fast and fabulous makeup setting spray that I found at Walmart. It was like $8, which is a cheap makeup setting spray. And it's out of the package. Unfortunately, this one is this one and another one's out of the package. So I decided to just use this today and so far I like it. So. Um, if you guys want me to do a review, let me know because I love setting spray. This is their this is Hard Candy's 12 Hour Power Long Wear Primer that I picked up at Walmart as well. And I didn't know they were going to come out with primer. I never liked their original primers. They were just kind of lotion based and it just kind of just broke me out. So um, I have this one on today so I will definitely let you guys know how I like this. I'm actually kind of excited because I like, I like long wear primers. If they say long wear and they're for oily skin or they say oil free, I'm gonna be on it because I have to have these kind of primers because I have oily skin and I'm out all day usually and it's hot here in Florida, it's humid weather, so we need that kind of power. Oh, I'm the last one to get on this wagon. Um, the Tiki bronzer highlighter from Hard Candy. <laughs> I am so excited that I got this. I hear that this is like the best, the best drugstore highlighter or something like that. Like people rave about this all the time and I'm really excited to try it. It looks pretty. Also, it's supposed to be as a bronzer from them, but I don't know. So, got some two, some new primers that um, Hard Candy came out with. They had four different ones. They had one for smoky eye, shimmer, regular eyeshadow, and like a long waterproof wear one. I just got the shimmer one and the regular one because I don't really. Well, Smoky, I wear a paint pot for my Smoky eyeshadows and don't really rub off, so I decided to just keep that one because it was like a dark base. It was like a black kind of primer, and I was like, nah. No, oh, thank you. Um, I can't wait to try these. I love primers. I love trying out new eyeshadow primers. Um, so I'll let you guys know if I like these. This one's for the shimmer, and this one's for like the regular, I guess, long wear. And it says extends the sh you wear any shadow, so yeah, I'm kind of excited to try that. I found these at Walmart. These are really cool. Like I told you, go to Walmart for like 20 things and you come out with like 100 million things. These are their new, um, what are these, their City Proof 24 Hour Eyeshadow, Waterproof Eyeshadows. And there's like, just like 20 different colors, but I only got like three, and this is supposed to be a universal primer. Um, and I've actually tried this one, I had this one on today, the primer, and I actually really love these so far. I have, cannot wait to try these and see how they wear. This one so far is wearing really nicely. Um, if you guys want me to do a review on these, I will definitely do a review on them. They remind me of the color tattoos from Maybelline, but in a stick form. So yeah, I picked up another. I picked up a backup of the Milani Brow Shaping Clear Gel because that's the brow gel I use for my set my eyebrows. Some backups. They were on sale too. They were like on sale for like fifty cents. Picked up some backups of the Elf Eyelid Primer because I like those. These are from Wet Wow. These were limited edition. I think they're their Silver Lake collection. They came out with like a few little six. Uh, six pan palette thingies. Sorry about the glare. 
They're really pretty. There's like a, a like a like a kind of like a neutral and I was like a pretty little pink one for springtime. I'm definitely gonna do. I'm gonna play with these. I cannot wait to. I cannot wait to break into these. This one was what I was excited about, and I actually have this on my eyes today, and I'm loving it so far. I cannot wait to do some tutorials and do a review for you all because this palette is worth the money and worth the searching for. It's the Maybelline. The, blood, the new Maybelline The Blush Nudes palette and it just came out I just found it the other day at Walmart and I was just like yes because <laughs> I found out about it on Instagram and Twitter and a few blog posts I follow and I really love it I have it on today I'm wearing it today and I will do a review full review on this palette and I will also do some tutorials for you guys if you want me to do this uh, like a tutorial on this look let me know because I actually want to do a tutorial on this look I have because it's absolutely beautiful picked up a uh, Burt's Bees Hydrating Coconut and Pear Little Lip Balm. Um, I tried the Wild Cherry one. <laughs> wild Cherry. Yeah, Wild Cherry one. I actually like it, so I decided to try the Coconut one. So yeah, I picked that up. And I found this at Target. It's the um, the new NYX Waterproof Eyeshadow Primer. I don't know what's so waterproof about it, but I can't wait to try that. It's like a little wand. Let's see if I can open it. Well, it's actually sealed. But it's like a little wand kind of thing. You just put it on I guess to help you guys enjoyed seeing this video and you got a peek at what's new in the drugstore I did pick up a lot a lot of these some of these things were backups and a lot of them were kind of like new stuff that's been at the drugstore and that you like it like at places like Target and Walmart so hopefully you got an idea of what's out in the drugstore that you'll be able to see you next time you're in Target or Walmart or CVS or Walgreens and hope you all enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next video bye <music>